Welcome back to All The Mods 9, episode 18. So I just want to go ahead and say something. I want to say thank you all so much so far for support on the videos and on the series. I didn't expect such a reception just to me playing Minecraft the way that I do and everything, but it's been awesome to hear from all of you, and I just want to say thank you. We just unlocked channel membership so I figured now was the time to talk about it. So thank you all so much. It has been an amazing journey so far, and we have so much more to do. We still have so much more to play, so much more to explore. And I'm honestly really anxious about what the future can hold, but I'm also super excited. Minecraft is only one of the many games that I play. You know, there's so much more that I could do, and this has been an amazing journey so far just for me, for self-discovery and everything else. It's shown that I really do enjoy making content, at least to some extent. I really enjoy explaining things and experiencing a journey with other people that are following along with me. It's been so fun so far, uh, and it's honestly changed the way that I look at even modded Minecraft, you know, it's it's absolutely insane. Typically at this point in the game, I would be kind of bored if I were playing by myself, but I'm still super excited. You guys show me new things every single day in the comments section. You talk about how I'm showing you something you've never seen before. It's so awesome to see all of that and to experience all of this with all of you. So I look forward to doing more and I look forward to continuing to meet more of you and also to engage with more of you folks. So thank you all so much and let's get into some gameplay. <laughs> well, that was weird. Who was that guy? Anyway, so last time we finished off with adding the flux network to the system. We've got a largely improved farm. We've got the starts of some bees. We've got a lot going on right now, man. We have so much that we can expand on. We have this little underground laboratory thing that we're starting on, which honestly makes me want to expand this out even more, add even more auto crafting. But right now the limiter is our power consumption or rather how much power we can actually have because this can't do enough for us. And even if we were to upgrade to the last reactor we still wouldn't have any insane late game power but we could go ahead and upgrade the reactor to the highest level and i believe that's what i want to do in this episode because i've really been wanting to kind of nip this power issue in the bud so we can go ahead and just have a massive amount getting stored in excess just so we can start working on maybe taking steps towards the ATM store. Now that doesn't mean that I'm looking to get to end game, but I'd like to make steps to prepare for us to do even more insane things. Like I want to set up enough power so we can have that chunk destroyer going at full blast as much as we can get it. I think, I think 100k FE per tick would be an awesome rate that we could put on that thing. Just so we can continue to increase our stores here because we're going to need a ton of resources if we're going to want to build any crazy kind of machines. So let's start thinking about that and start making our way towards getting more power. And to start off, let's go ahead and collect these quest rewards. Oh, look at that. There's so many rewards. I think I have to go into here. Oh, yeah. Uncommon. Ooh, a solar panel basic. There you go. We already have end game power just with that thing. <laughs> now let's go check over here. We're going to need to, I don't know what the best energy cubes are, but I know for sure that this elite is not gonna cut it. We might even be better off just having this here be our main energy cube because I'm pretty sure this is only, tw this is 25 million. This is a hundred, this is storing a hundred million and this is storing 25 million, so. Yeah, I don't know. Um, what the hell? I got my friggin' llamas in the house. What the hell? How much fluids are we? Are we maxed out on fluids? No, we're not. That's crazy. What is our... Uh, oh, where's our fluid gear? Right here. We have 
Damn, that is so much fluid XP. Goodness. Well, let's just go ahead and turn that mug on. And look at this. We're already two, two discs already full. That's crazy. Even with these drawers here. That is nuts. All right. So let's look at power. I want to get at least that reactor done, but I also might take a look at doing the mechanism reactor. I've never done that before. Uh, I've always stuck with power, but for what I want to do, we're going to need a lot. So let's look at the spirited reactor here and see how much we're going to need. So we're going to need four for one and we need 36. So that's going to be 144 spirited crystals. Spirited crystals take one emerald and one million FE per tick or sorry, 1 million FE to complete. So we're going to need to upgrade these down here. I actually need to turn my volume down. This is so loud for me. Let's go ahead and do that. Uh, these are hardened, are all these hardened ones? So, and these are basics as well. This is also a basic and this is a basic. So we only have two hardened ones. Okay, um, let's go ahead and do that. Oh, I need to turn on my magnet and let's take this one as well. Are you also a basic? You are. We also might want to increase this. Oh, we're also going to need to change these cables. These aren't going to be strong enough for what we need. I don't believe. Just grab some more though. I don't think these are going to be able to output enough, but we'll see. So we have the two hardened ones there and what do we need to upgrade this? So we're going to need a quartz block and we need hardened capacitors. And then if we upgrade further, we're going to need blazing capacitors, which only does 4K. So we're going to need to get up to maybe niotic. Maybe blazing would be fine since we're going to have 12 rods. But that also does mean that we're going to need a ton of these. So if we're going to have 12 rods. We're going to need to do this six times. So we're going to need we're going to need 24 blazing crystals. How many do we have? We have 71. Okay, so we can go ahead and already do that. We just need to make more blazing capacitors. Actually, I think we're going to need more than that because it's two per, right? And we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Well, that's because we don't have a ton of them. But we will need those, so that should be plenty. Now we need to go ahead and work on the hardened stuff. So let's check hardened. Yeah, we're going to need more energized steel. So let's go here and craft some energized steel. I'll just craft 128. We'll get that going. That should get pumped out. I wonder if there's a better way to do the energizing orb. So we don't just have to do one at a time. Probably, there probably is. There's probably a much better way to do this, but what do I know? I, I just, I barely know automation, man. Also, I've messed with my mic settings in OBS a little bit. Hopefully things sound more smooth for when I'm talking lower and when I'm talking higher, I put a cutoff so it doesn't go above a certain level, but also I've added a gain. So even when I'm quiet, it should still be, you should still be able to hear me quite well. Um, that'll take a lot of time off of me editing my voice in post where I'm super quiet and then I have to boost it and then I'm super loud and then I have to lower it. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping that's nice. I've also noticed that the music is quite loud. So I'm going to turn that down a little bit too. You guys can feel free to leave me any any feedback in the comments. I'm still still getting used to all this. Now we need to make, we're going to have to make some blocks of quartz. So let's just go ahead and make a stack of these because we will need them. Let's go ahead and make some hardened capacitors because we're going to need quite a few of these. So let's do that. And let's upgrade these. So these do 1k FE per tick. I think if we get up to blazing, we should be okay. So I'm going to try that and hope that it's all good with the blazings. We'll have to grab those other two as well that we have sat down there. So that's those. And then we'll grab these two. Oops. Grab those. And we'll chuck this in here and this in here. So having all of these should be enough. Oh, come on. Really? You're not going to give me the next one because they all have different energy stats. What the hell did I just do? I don't know what that sound was, but it really confused me. Blazing and blazing. Okay, so those are all the blazings are there. Dang. So they do 4K per tick. So that's quite a bit. Uh, let's just make two more. Let's go ahead and make two more energizing orbs here. And we will upgrade these all the way to blazing as well. 
All right, perfect. We had enough. That's good. So hopefully now we should be able to go ahead and make the Niotic. This is going to be a lot of power, or not Niotic. We need to make the, what's the level after Niotic? What's it called? Spirited, I think. So we're going to need to make 144 of these. Let's just go ahead. Yeah, we'll go ahead and make 144. We'll put those in. And I'm going to, did it already go in? Yeah, it did. Oh yeah, these, yeah, these, these are fast now. That's good. Takes about two and a half seconds to charge it. That's not bad, but that is really going to drain our power like big time. Oh, you're still going up uh, and then you're going down and then you're going up. That's good. That is good. But this is not going to be able to keep up with this alone. Luckily we have that over there too. I actually want to check the network right here. What are, how are we looking? We're still good. Are we still good over here? Uh, cause we don't really have anywhere storing power. How are you doing? Oh, you're doing just fine. Okay, sweet. These are all outputting at max capacity. All right. Still have a good reserve of ethylene here. That's good. All right. Yeah, we should be fine to finish the niotic or not the niotic, the spirited. I really want to get to the last level. What's the last level called again? The nitro reactor. I don't know if we'll be able to get to that because I believe these take a ton of power. Uh, they take 20 million each, but it does make 16. Um, and I, th how much do we need for these? Four again. So we're going to need 144 of these. So we'd have to make 16. So we're going to have to go ahead and make 160. So that'll be 10 times. So it's going to be 200, and milli 200 million power. Oh, here these guys go to ruin my life. All right, I guess it's time to go to night night. I really need to get that charm that stops those things from spawning. That would be cool, I think. Oh, look, XP. Nice. This thing can't even get filled up fast enough, can it? Nope. No, it cannot. And is that... It's because you have you have speed. Oh, but you're a regular exporter. Do I have another... I don't have an elite exporter. So let's go ahead and do this. Two, three. Let's break that. And chuck that in there. And now we can make the elite exporter. We'll go ahead and toss this downstairs. Then we'll put the speed upgrades in that. Uh, where is it? Where are you? Where is that thing, man? Am I blind? I thought it was like, ah, oh, it's right here. So right here. And then we'll chuck the speed upgrades in there. Now we need to do, we have to grab a fluid XP bucket and toss it in there. So let's turn this crap here, go to fluids, go up here, grab this, do that. Oh, that thing is filling up now. Dang. We can do that. That's so nice. What a nice feature. Thank you, XP. I appreciate it. So many XPs. Chicken, go. Oh, rip. Man, no chicken. Oh, look. I think this is that one chicken. We need to name him. He's going to be Mr. Cluckington. We'll put a dot here, too, because he's official. Yep, just like that. Mr. Cluckington. Come here. There you go. Yeah, he's him. I wish I could get, like, chicken armor or something and put it on him. <laughs> what do you have for me, buddy? Oh, you're that same guy. Get out of here. You got your damn llamas over here. I hope I didn't kill my chicken. Oh, I didn't. Sweet. He's immune to the splash damage. All right, spirited. How many do we have? 64. Not enough. Let's check on... Our power real quick and see if we can up the chunk destroyer how are we doing over here still are we good so you're still getting filled up but you are getting drained a little bit what's your output oh you're not outputting anything of course what about you you're also just telling me input you're not telling me output okay what about up here this also isn't telling me but we are getting drained slowly you're outputting 25k what's under here you're also not telling me. That's dumb. I would like to know, please. That's why Flux Networks would be nice, because it would tell me everything. <laughs> we probably need to set up um, sugar cane over here with the cactus. Okay, so here we'll probably set a, set one there, and we'll do this, and we will grab... I don't, I don't know if I need water there, but I'm going to do this. Okay, there we go. And that will grow, and then it will also get put in the system. Nice. I might break this whole system here and just put fences above because it's going to break them anyway. I'm gonna do this. That should break them, right? And then I can do this. 
And then do this. They'll break slower, right? Or the sugar cane won't break. Okay. So I do have to have one destructor right here. But the cactus will break. So we do that. There we go. That'll work. Hmm. Huh. Oh, man. Quit going in there. So we'll put this here. And let me break this and this. And I want to do that. Oh, did it put the cable away? I bet it did. So we'll take some cables. There we go. So sugarcane again. Just in case it does grow a bit more. But now we have sugarcane coming in and we have cactus. How much cactus do we have? 2.8k. We probably need to set up a drawer over here for cactus as well. Cactus. Can you get compressed? No, you can't. Okay. So we can just make a regular drawer like one of these. And we'll put cactus, sugarcane, and such in there. So let's grab a 2x2 two two drawer. We really need to set up somewhere to put these. Cactus. Cactus, sugarcane. There. And let's get our exporter again like we always do. And let's just push all this stuff out. Grab this. I need these. Oh, I need more upgrades. Oh, no. It took connecting glass. That's fine. Doesn't matter. Do the stack. And then we need one more speed upgrade. Do I not have any other glass? I don't, actually. Because it's only crafting as it needs it. So let's go ahead and make some glass. Just want to make some more speed upgrades to have them. Thank you. Do that, and I need cables. Do I have cables on me? I put them up there in my inventory. I lied. So we'll come over yonder, and we'll do this. Oh, whoops. There we go, okay. And we'll do this again. So we'll do that, take that out. Put a stack upgrade in there. Cactus. Do cactus. Oh, whoops. Sugarcane. We'll put those in there. Oh, dang it. I forgot to block it. Whoops. So we got to take those out. I need to grab my locking tool. And we need to go in here. Take these out. We need to lock this first. And we'll link it. Just put all the cactus away. Do that. Sugarcane. Cactus. Now I need upgrades for this. And we'll upgrade these to gold. Oh, I have plenty of those. So do those. Are you working? These should work, right? Oh, is it because? Let's remove that. There we go. Okay. Now we add it. Oh, whoops. Add. Boom. There we go. Yeah, get stored. Okay, so now we can store millions in there. You, yeah, I'll just throw that in there just to be safe. You also need more storage. We just need to upgrade all these. So let's do that. Do that. We'll upgrade you. And we'll get 1.9k. We'll upgrade this one. There we go. Okie dokie. Artichoke. We're good to go with that. That pulled some stuff out of here, right? Yeah. A few thousand. A few of them. Um... Okay, you're good. Sugar cane. Sweet. What is getting used? Oh, it's making sugar. Is it? Is it using sugar? No? Okay. How's our sand looking? Actually, we just saw it appear, right? 502 sand. Is it still is it still making sand over here? Yeah. Just waiting on fire essence. Okay, so the fire essence is slow. Do we have our thingies now? Okay, sweet. We have the spirited crystals done. So we can start thinking about that. But all this junk away. Okay, let's go ahead and grab the reactor. What are you doing over here? 
Ah. Again. Come back with better stuff. You're wasting my dang time. So we're going to need to take this and we're going to need to make some spirited capacitors. So let's go ahead and do that. It should auto craft those again for us. There we go. And thank you, sir. Now we do this. Throw those in there. Now we make the spirited reactor. Yeah. We'll do that. We'll chuck these away. Yeah, we got the spirited reactor now. So it can produce 88k. Look at that. We just increased our power like crazy. Oh, hello, llama. Goodbye, llama. Let's put this away. Let's start working on the nitro. Start working on the nitro crystals, which we're going to need to make 160 of. Oh, we need block of blazing crystal. Let's go ahead and put the recipe in there for that because I don't want to deal with that problem. So blazing crystal block. Let's tell it how to make that. Whoops. We'll do this. Then we can toss this in the crafter here and then we can still go ahead and do this and it should take care of everything else that we need. Yep. It'll make, it'll make the blazing crystals and it'll make the blocks. Very nice. Okay, let's go. And then we can check our crafting monitor here. And as you can see, it is working. Let's go check on the progress over here. How slow are you? That's not that's not too slow at all. Oh shit. I ruined it. No. <laughs> Chicken. Damn it. Uh I ruined it. So that I wasted like 10 million. Yeah, like 12 million FE. Whoops. This will go. It's, I mean, it's producing 86k. How much uranite are we at now? We are uranite. Where are you? We have 387. That's good. That is good. Let's check down here. I want to improve this farm even more. So we need red, blue, or sorry, orange, blue, and red. So we have no reds. Okay. We need to make another master crystal because we already have one in the, oh, if I make another master crystal, I have to go up to the machine over here before I do that and tell this to not export master infusions because this one's staying in here because we changed this to ext C. I don't know what this ext C is for, but ext C makes it so that the infusion crystal stays. So that's why we have this going. Uh, okay. How are we sitting on? Inferium. We're doing pretty good. So let's go ahead and make a master infusion crystal. We need to make that. Okay. Mystical. We should have one of these. Oh, dang. We didn't have any left. Rip. Oh, we can do this one here. Boom, 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 boom. We got to change this crystal out. One, two, three, four. We need to do 12. We can't do 12. Okay. Now we need to do these. Do those. Actually, I think we're going to need more. So I'll just make all of that. And then we'll also have to come over to this one and make this into the orange. And we'll do this too. To the blue. We'll put that away. And we will just make all of that. Okay. Let's go ahead and do this. We're going to need to make three more of these. And we should be able to make the master crystal. Like so. There we go. Master Crystal achieved. So now we have our own Master Crystal. And we can just do this. We'll just make a ton of this. Kick our Inferium all the way down to 7k. That was very loud. And we'll take the Prudentium. And we'll kick this way down too. Okay. Now we should be able to make a stack of the blue. There we go. Oh, we're probably going to need to make two stacks actually if i want for what i want to do so we'll do that and we'll probably make some more uh prudentium i'm thinking i want to get a lot of the farm sorted oh man i almost sneezed and i just sat here for like 30 seconds trying to get it out but it wouldn't go <laughs> okay we need oh no hold on we gotta check our prosperity we're at 46 oh man 
bees are you not doing do i have you set to output right you just are mad slow oh i need to put an expansion box here that's what i forgot to do so we'll make an oak expansion box do i not have any i was about to say i know i have combs i was about to say nah so let's make an oak expansion box for this one go this way go over yonder ways oh you guys have honey zombie when did i get a zombie did he just move in on his own okay i guess all right I, okay i don't know where you came from buddy i i have no idea but all right i think he literally just moved in on his own i'm i don't know where he came from i have no idea no you punks oh man i need my bee cages these guys are trying to lead. They're trying to make a break for it. Get over here. Until I find out where you can live, you are just going to stay in these cages. Because you just caused me too many problems that I don't want to deal with. Okay, so let's get this. With this thing here, we can add perks to the bees. If we search productive. See these here? These upgrade bases. We can add upgrades to these so they do more work. So let's do that if I can spell. So we need to make some upgrade bases. So let's do that. Oh, I need to make honey treats. Okay. Um, okay. Honey treats. I should have, I'll have one bottle. I'll do four upgrades and let's see what upgrades we can do. So we can do that one, but then that means we need the productivity alpha. Okay. So this increases the product productivity and this increases the speed at which they do it. So we probably want multiples of those. How much combs do we have? We have 42 combs. So let's just do two upgrades because we can't afford to do any more. We will do a speed upgrade or the time spent in the hive. Yeah, the upgrade speed. And then we'll do the productivity alpha. Oh, nope, we need draconic stuff for that. Okay, so that means we need a, is it an ender bee? Draconic bee. How do you get the draconic bee? You need to use dragon's breath on an obsidian nest. Okay, so we're going to have to go get that. And then we're going to have to use a dragon's egg to make a dragon egg nest for that bad boy. As much as I didn't want to do bees, look at me. I'm doing bees over here. I'm doing the, the work for the bees. I'm going to have to extend this out to get more room to work with here. I need more space. So let's go ahead and make some more. I did all that terraforming just to make it look ugly again. Oh well. That's okay, Dad. Whatever, I'll just leave it like this for now. I'm just going to leave it here and we will make some um, connecting glass. Oh, we have some. Okay, sweet. So we have some of this. So we'll do this here. And now I need spruce slabs. We're going to extend this out to here. And we'll break this, 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 and this. And we'll break this here and this here. We're going to place the bee egg there. Place these on top. I sure hope the bees can't get out of that spot. Because that would suck. There we go. We have more room four more bees okay so you do you need a dragon egg i think to in order to farm properly so i'll just place that there and hope that's what you need actually what i'll do is i'll just put that there there you go and then when we get the bee we'll put it in there i don't know if they'll be able to get out so i'm just gonna enclose this like so uh oh just do that just in case i don't want him to get out okay now we need to go get that bee before i go i'll go ahead and install this upgrade in here but i would like to get why are you so full of honey oh you need bottles what in the world why are the why are there prospera combs in here huh I think I messed up somewhere with my pipes or something. 
Did I do something weird back here? Oh, because I didn't tell it to do that. Duh. That would make total sense because it's trying to, <laughs> it's trying to find somewhere to put them. Um, I need to tell. Maybe I need to disconnect these bees here. Yeah, I think I have to. So I need to disconnect this. And do item pipes around it. Because I want to keep those. Oh, dang it. We're going to need to make more item pipes. I would like to keep those combs for upgrades. So I'm going to just bend this around here. And I'm going to put an importer on this one. To import everything that it's outputting here. So we'll grab this. And we'll grab the cables here. Because I want to keep everything these guys are making. Yep, there we go. Okay, that works. So let's go ahead and do this. We'll just chuck these in there and hope we get some prosperity from them. Look at that. It looks so cool like that. Just spinning around. I bet it kills your FPS too. <laughs> ah, this, you are going to be a problem child. So this glass I put here doesn't even matter. Because I'm going to have to place an item pipe here anyway. I hope that you can be piped into. Break that pipe. And then we need to come over here and do that. And hopefully take everything out of there. Take some bottles. Why do we have so many bottles? Dang. All right, whatever. We'll leave that there. Now we need to make an obsidian nest. So I should have a... Oh, I need a diamond sword for this one. Okay. Obsidian nest. We need dragon's breath, which I should have some from earlier on. There we go. So now we need to go to the end. Is this in the end? This should be in the end, right? Nice, it is. Okay, so it's up here. Uh, do I have my bee cages? I do. Nice. I just tried to ac access my storage. It didn't even work. Okay, so let's go down here. Go over here, and we'll do this. We'll just use a bunch of this. Because I don't feel like waiting that long. All right. And we will catch our draconic bee, and we'll do it again as well. Which means I should have saved some dragon's breath, because the next one's going to take even longer. That's okay. Hello. Thank you. And let's get one more. Yeah, the way 80 seconds. Hey. Enderby. Come here. What you got? You ain't even playing no music, boy. Just look around here for some stuff. There's more Greg Tech. Prosperity. Get in me, pocket. I always need more of that. 24. Nice. Greg Tech spawns so weird, dude. More prosperity. I was hoping that was prosperity. Dang it. Take this. More prosperity. Thank you. And even more prosperity. Thank you. There's some more. Hey, what are you angry about, dude? What the hell was that little shot at me? What are those? Is that from a shulker? What in the world? Oh, there's a shulker all the way down there. Well, this is coming out soon. Hey. I'm glad the bee wasn't here. It would have died. Thank you, bee. Oh, there we go. Got the bee. Okay, let's kill this shulker. And let's turn our magnet on. Whoa. Oh, the shulker hit me. Must must have. So let's grab our nest. What the hell? Okay, let's go down here and deal with this guy. Why am I getting teleported? Thank you, sir. Shulker shell. A crazy axe with efficiency 7 on it. It's going to be really nice. I can put that on my pickaxe. Let's grab some more prosperity. What the hell? Why am I getting teleported? Oh, is it because I have the ender bee in my pocket, maybe? That could be it. I don't know. I don't know much about that. I'm going to assume that's why. So let's go home. And we'll put the ender bee away. And we'll get the two draconic bees over here so we can get some of that draconic dust. Uh, hello, zombie. We're also going to need a way to get that draconic stuff out. 
Oh, never mind. I think it just comes out of the combs. Oh, I got an Enderman spawn egg. That's neat. I think they just come out of the combs. So I'm just going to do that and do that. Okay. And hopefully we'll get some combs whenever they wake up. All right. Well, we did that. Let's check on this. It's done. Okay. Does that mean we can make the reactor now? Oh, whoops. Got to take these out of here now. So let's put those away. And let's upgrade this to the reactor nitro after we build all of these. 21. You can't make any more of these. You got to make more clay balls. We're missing dirt essence. Oh, no. This sucks. It's because of the sand crafter down there, huh? Hey, you. Give me that. Oh, man, I got scammed. Give me that. I need clay. So I can make some of these. I got scammed, man. We need 36 of these. Now we should be able to upgrade to this. Give me that. Yes. Nitro reactor, baby. Oh, man. It's going to be so good. Go, go, go. So good. Look at that. Oh, man, look at that. It's so good. Yes, I am so pleased. Look at, oh, man, it could store 500 million power. And it generates 220K. It's so sweet. Oh, hell yeah. All right, let's go. And let's go to our chunk destroyer and tell it to use more power. How are you doing over here? You're, yeah, you're not even close to done. How, f oh my God, it has so much more to do. Look at this. I forgot how large I made it. It's 16 by 16. Yeah. Oh, I turned off hover. That almost ruined me. Oh my goodness. Look at all that all the modium down there. Holy cow. Okay, let's go and tell this to go faster. How much should we do? 100? 100k? Let's do it. Look at the speed now. Look at it going. Oh, yeah. Yep. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Yes. Hell yeah, dude. Oh, my goodness. Now we have enough power to put the dimensional... Uh, to put the wireless thing down over here and use the dimensional card in it. Because we have it in here, but it doesn't do anything for us. So let's break this transmitter and let's make the wireless transmitter or let's grab this wireless transmitter. Let's place this, I guess, here and let's throw the dimension card in. Yes. The reason we couldn't do it before is because it used 8000 FE. But now it doesn't even matter. We were producing 200. What was that? 218 K over here. It depends on multiple factors but let's see yeah 220k and then we also have 20k over there so we are absolutely chilling with the power at the moment i am so very pleased with that that is so awesome hell yeah yes let's go man all right that's what i like to see baby yeah baby that's what i've been waiting for yeah it's so good okay now that we have that done Let's first go to sleep so the bees can start working again. I think there's a time in a bottle or something. I could be completely wrong, but I believe there's something similar to that. Yeah, here it is. Time in a bottle. You have to store time. You need unobtainium. Oh, okay. And I guess that skips things around. I've never used it before, but I'm going to add that because that sounds like it could be cool to mess with. Okay, let's collect some quest rewards. We got a ton of stuff. That's what I like to see. Oh, we completed some more. There we go. That's what I like to see. Look at all that stuff we got, man. Ding. Okay, let's toss that in there. Let us go ahead and make the next upgrade if we can. I'm still waiting on draconic chunks, which we get draconic dust from. We get draconic dust from the combs, so we won't. This is a 30% chance. Oh, 
so we're, it's gonna be a while until we get that well in the meantime what we could do is make another one of the b things the time ones where's it at right here 20 percent decreases the time in the hive by 20 percent. so let's do that we'll make one more of those so we can have them spend less time you can't upgrade the draconic hive though with an expansion box which sucks but that's okay so let's go over here and we'll drop this in so they are why are you sitting there why does it go there it should go in here right so it gets output i am confused yeah you're set to out oh it's because of you you bastard you've been cutting into my prosperity earnings all right we have 74 prosperity we're good that's what we're gonna be running out of when we make these growth accelerators so we needed let's go check what we needed down here i think we needed orange then blue yeah we need orange then blue so let's go ahead and make some of these go into here and we're gonna have to make some more of these eight of those i believe because we're gonna need to make uh 24 of these so let's do that go in here and do that okay and we'll place these down would be better to just use the wand huh like so there we go now we can make the blue ones i think we can we're gonna run out of prosperity after we do this set we'll have only a few left so let's do this and do that boom and we'll make two more sets of these like so we'll come down here with the wand and we'll do this and this okay well those are almost fully all the way down which is really nice i need to exchange this soil too or maybe i need to use that red fertilizer soil that uh pilpa was talking about yeah our urine is going to be kicking off now and honestly we could do with making another power reactor we'd have even more power that could be cool that could be pretty neat that could be a good idea i think but yeah that'd be honestly sick if we could have two of these going then we can upgrade the chunk destroyer even further beyond let's check what upgrades i can do for these well not while i'm standing there because it's going to get very loud i believe there was something to increase their spawn range or the range that i can spawn at ah it's prismarine shark crystals which i'm going to need to kill some guardians for and then get some guardian predictions i think that sounds like a good idea guardian or not guardian we need to do these the model frameworks um we're out of clay again because we're out of dirt seeds man what's our prosperity like we only have 19 dang it i need to upgrade the dirt seeds where are they at dirt you were right there so dirt you need to get upgraded buddy we're gonna upgrade the dirt seeds which are so those are your urine tonight I think that's the dirt right it was the second one yeah okay so we're gonna do these on that one so the dirt comes in faster no i don't whatever i'm just gonna place them i don't feel like messing with the wand right now narrator oh. narrates all god that scared me holy crap narrator off that was so freaking loud oh my god i jumped like actually let's unbind that was it control B that I was pressing? Yep. Let's get rid of that. That was not good. Narrator. N narrator. Off. It's still doing it. I had control plus B and it's off. You. Damn it. Is it in accessibility settings? Narrator off. Can I just not turn that off? That sucks. That's a, that was so like that. That show was so loud. I didn't like that one bit. Oh man, that thing's gonna keep using the dirt. Um, okay, well, come here. And you. We're gonna need more dirt seeds. <laughs> Goodness. So let's make some clay. Now I need to remember what the hell I was even making that for. Ah, oh, the data. The model frameworks. Before I got scared into oblivion by that damn thing. Oh, it took all my clay. You bastard. I have 12 sand. These things are going so dang fast. Well, it knows how to make sand, so I'm just going to cancel this for now. 
I'll keep that with me because the system's just gonna eat it up. Okay, all right. We have our model frameworks. Now what we need to do is look for those prismarine, the prismarine biome thing. So let's go under water. What is it? Um, crystals and let's see what drops you. So the elder guardian, is it the possessed elder guardian that this drops the smithing template for the tide armor trim. This drops the heart of the sea possessed elder guardian, elder guardian prediction. What can you give me? It can't give me this, the heart of the sea. What can drop that? Oh, I have to make it. Okay. So I have to make it with nether stars and antimatter or I make it with diamond essence, squid essence, and prismarine essence. Maybe I do that. Can you be dropped? Oh, I need fish essence and prismarine essence for that. Or I can find a beach creeper. That could be cool too. Maybe I'll also get an elder guardian spawn egg. That'd be cool. Okay, so let's try to get an elder guardian model, I guess. What is it under here? There's an underwater village. Well, that's cool. Whoa, hey, bud. Hey, relax yourself. A gym. They have emeralds. What were you? Ocean creeper. Oh, here's that crazy spinning guy. He dropped the coral spear thing. Can I do that cool move too? No, I'm not that cool, I guess. Where was the... Is a hundred blocks this way? Is this it? Oh, I must have done the wrong thing then. Whoa, are those... I need a swab if that's what I think it is. Freaking blowfish. Ouch. Thank you. I got Tobiko and 18 pufferfish. So now I can make a pufferfish spawner because I got the DNA. Let's go. Let's put some of that stuff away. Holding five. Okay, I don't need anything else. I don't think this was the ocean temple. But it says it was. It says it's... Well, there's an underwater village. That's cool, I guess. Is it Ocean Monument? Yeah, that's what it is. Okay. Yep, 3,000 blocks away. Yep, it's Ocean Monument. I was being silly. Well, time to find this thing. Oh, we passed it. Whoops. That's what I get for looking at my phone. All right, let's let the world load, I guess. I think the world's trying to figure something out. <laughs> Any day now. I would really like to have the map load, please. I think I overloaded the server or something. Or the game can't figure out what to do. I think it's behind. Yeah, because it's not even charging my jetpack. I'm just going to go plant myself over here while it figures out itself. Okay, so we're back on land. I'm gonna go ahead and let the server catch up. I'm just gonna land right here and I'll let it go. Okay, so I'm unsure, but my world might be corrupted. Um, that sucks, I don't know why. I'm going to try to find a backup and hopefully it'll be fine. All right. I've rolled back my ATM9 version. We got rolled back in the world. I really, really, really hope that things are okay. I ran into actually quite a few problems. So I am really hoping that things are all right because it was not good. Like I got, I got back to the, to the board of where the world rendered again and it, was not rendering anymore, like at all, like over here. So I hope it renders. I hope it renders more. 
Okay, it's rendering. Okay, I think we saved it. Oh, I think we saved it. Oh, man. It was so... If you're playing all the mods 9, don't update to 0.2.36. I updated to that, and it messed my entire game up. What is this? Holy crap, the sunken city. Yo, we got to explore this thing, too. Oh man, this thing is sick looking. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna tag this. This looks so badass. Hell yeah, dude. We are definitely exploring that thing. Look at that. Holy crap. That is dope. Okay. Alright, back to what we were gonna do. <laughs> Unfortunately, we lost the the puffer fish, so we don't have that anymore. Which really sucks, but at least we get to keep our world. So that's what matters. We'll grab some more mob swabs just in case. And oh, here we go. So we need one of these, probably two of these. Actually, we'll just we'll just grab all four. So we have guardian data now. Let's go in here and chuck these in. Now we need to kill seven of them. Or six of them to get a basic one. I thought we had unlimited breath but we do not we probably want that if we're going to be doing this so let's go up here let's place a waste stone ocean monument let's uh go home real quick breathe let's see breathe underwater oh here we go we can put this on do we have a bat backpack Okay, sweet, we do have one. Okay, all right, let's go back to the ocean monument. There should be a button for the ability. Ability enabled, there we go. Okay, that was weird. All right, uh, how's our data model? We are good to go on that. Now we need to make some more for the guardian. So let's do that. Oh, damn it, we're out of clay. All right, we'll go down here and I wanna also grab these we'll grab some sea lanterns there we go give me your sea lanterns oh there we go we have the mining fatigue big time now okay well i guess that means we have to go in so now we have to try to find that big boy through these through this little maze in here not this way. Not that way either. And if I can remember, I'll try not to kill him. So we need to go through here. Well, is this it? Elder Guardian. Are you the one I need to kill? I sure hope so. I hope that's the one I needed the data model for. Oh, damn it, but I shouldn't have killed him, because now I can't get the data. Damn it, I'm so silly. Maybe I should have swabbed him. Damn it, I hope we find another one. Shoot. At least I remember to get the data. We can go up. Hopefully there's one more so I can swab it. Kind of did a big goof right there. Ah, right, here you are. Swab you. Okay, you dropped the heart of the sea. That's good. I don't know if these guys can, like, spawn here or anything, so. But we did kill one. We have to kill six of them, though. Wish the spawn egg might be good for that. There's loot in here. Ooh. Some free stuff and things. I always like free stuff and things. Oh, we're already at advanced. Nice. Okay, well, I got what I came for. So we're good on that front. Just grabbing some kelp. What is this room? Well, I'm just gonna go slash home. Grab us a bucket. So we can get rid of the mining fatigue. All we have to do is go over to a cow. Grab some milk. There we go. Now mining fatigue is gone. Okay. Let's go ahead and empty this out. Let's throw some of this stuff away too. Move this stuff around. Okay, so we did get 
at least some um, prismarine. Well, we got some prismarine. Did we get the other stuff too? Um, I think we need the elder guardian to do that. So we need to make some GM chicken feed. What do you have for me, buddy? Garbage. Trash. Okay, chickens. Um, yep, it's your turn. Sweet, 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 sweet. So we have that now. We need a one of the cardboard boxes with a spawner in it. We're going to go down here and we're going to do this. And this is silverfish. So now we're going to take the Elder Guardian spawn egg and put that on there. That spawn delay is horrible. Take some Aldamodium and we'll lower this. Oh, the min spawn delay. We can't do the other one. Okay, so this is at least going. Do we have another agitator? Can we make one? We don't have any ghast tears, but we can make ghast tears. Oh, there's one. All right, I need to... Before he does anything, I need to turn these in. We'll put those into there. Now. There we go. That's two. Agitator. Grab this. Put this on there. Now he's agitated his funk. Let's get a redstone. We need a redstone comparator. Let's put some redstone control on this. Okay, now we need a lever. Now I need to figure out which one it is. So one, two, three. So one, two. Oh, damn. Whoops. Um, dirt, come here. Go there. Okay, so now we can do the lever under that. Turn that on. There we go. We have three more that we need to kill. And then we can get that bad boy spawning. We have the smithing trim. That's cool. How do you get the prismarine shards? Need the guardian spikes, which come from the guardians. You telling me? To, oh, hello, bud. Goodbye. Did we get any guardian spikes? We did, and we got guardians. What can we do with these? Oh, you can make guardian soup. Delicious. Wait, that? No, that didn't work at all. Goodbye, sir. We need one more, and then we can throw them into the data model thing. Prismarine. So we do have some crystals, which is good. Oh, I did the recipe wrong. That's why. Well, we can get Wilden Spikes at least, and this guy will give us some stuff too. Sweet. We have the ones that all the ones that we needed. So let's go down here and turn this off. Watch, I'm gonna forget about this spawner too. Let's turn that off. Let's let's do this that we'll take this with us all right so we have the spawner again it's in our backpack we have some of the crystals here so let's go over here turn this off and turn this one off and let's see what this does so we can remember why we're doing this so it, it increases the activation range so they'll run while i am further away which is what we want that would be ideal. So let's go up here. And let's see their activation range, 16. Can we go up even further? Oh, it increases it by two, nice. So I just did 12 on that one. Okay, let's grab some more. We're not gonna have enough to do everything right now, but that's fine, so that's... Oh, that one already had increased range. So let's come over here. Wither, Slime, Blaze, Witch. We can do four, at least. So those are increased as well. So at least this will work while I am further away. That's what matters. So they, it will work from a farther distance. So while we're around the house, anywhere around the house, it should be good to go. It should always be going. At least I hope it does. I really, really do. How's our power situation? We are absolutely chilling. Yes, that's what I like to see. These should, these aren't slowing down. Hmm. It's maybe because this is so close. Maybe if we remove this one and we have that one be the main one, it'll be good. But we also want these to be able to work too. It might be ideal to move this here, the flux plug. I don't know if that has anything 
directly that's doing it. I don't know if that's the exact cause, but let's place this here. Let's check the stats. You're not working anymore. Oh, I know why. It's because of this. So energy, energy on top. Oh, sorry, front output. So the front is outputting now. This should, all right, there we go. Now it's running again. Sweet. Okay. All right, so it was the flux plug that was causing these to run at full speed, I think. No, they're still going. They're still kicking off fully. I mean, that's fine. That is totally fine. But at least this is getting drained too. So it gets drained. And then does it pick back up again? Okay, sweet. All right. You're still going at full speed. How are we doing here? You're full as hell. You, oh my gosh. Look at all this stuff, man. I'd really like to get some iron going in there. So I'm going to try to force this machine here. Like so. I think I'm going to bottleneck everything because I think I messed up by taking 64 out of here. I mean, hey, we're we're getting we're getting all the ore. So that's what matters. Okay, we need to put the guardians. We need to make another loot fabricator. Where's my where's Mr. Cluckington? Where are you at? Are you somewhere over here? I don't know where you are and I don't want to kill you, so Get out of my way. All right, we need to make another loot fabricator. Probably make two of them. Oh, not loot fabricators. Dang it. We need these simulation chambers. I actually might go ahead and just grab them anyway. Take that, and we'll take the simulation chambers. We'll grab the fabricators. Now we need gates. Actually, let's go ahead and do flux network points. Let's make two points. Just make four just in case. Um, the way that I want to do this now. So we have this one, the loot fabricator. And let's place... Why do you have another one on you? Okay, remove that. You should still have way more than enough power. So we'll place this. And we'll place this. And now we want to place this. And I don't know how much you're going to need. So I'm going to change your limit to 10,000. Do that. Go select on the network. We'll select wireless power. You should be getting power. There we go. So those are getting power. Now we'll do loot fabricator, loot fabricator, place this, and we'll make this one 10,000 as well. Put that on wireless power. So these are getting power now. Okay, now we need item pipe for these two so they can draw in what they need from here. Okay, you already have an upgrade, that's good. And now we need exporters and importers to these. Okay, so we'll do the same thing that we did over there. We'll go behind here. Now we will place these on here and I'll do that. Okay, so you need guardian, guardian prediction. And you can do also Guardian Prediction. All right. Now I'm going to toss the Guardian in here. And I'll toss the Guardian in here. So those will get running. And we'll have more for later. And once they start getting outputted, then we'll decide what we want from these two. All right, sweet. Yeah, this is really nice, the flex points over these. Like, yeah, I have, I have to space them out. But honestly, if I did it, in the correct way. I could put a whole cube <laughs> of them around this thing and it would just fit every face and it would just sit in the center of all of them. But I don't want to do that. So I ain't gonna. Okay, so you guys need importers as well. I see. And there's another reason. There's another reason why we want these things. And it has to do it has to do with enchanting as well. And the reason is you need the C this right here, the heart of the C. You're going to need this for the heart forged shelf. And this is when you start getting into the latest game of crafting. But you'll also need the heart of the sea though for the abyssal sacrifice. 
which then you turn into the Wither's Compass, which belongs with the ATM Star. So that's why I wanted to get this sorted out. Because I felt like it would be a good idea. Okay, so let's go ahead. We're going to select Prismarine Crystals for this one. And what can we even make with Guardian Spikes again? I know we can make Prismarine Crystals, but what else? We can do Guardian Charms and Prismarine Shards and Crystals. Okay, so let's do that then. So we'll do we'll do the spikes for this one, and we'll do the shard the shard, uh, crystals for that one. These should be getting put in like one by one. It shouldn't all go to that one. There, I hope it should it should go to both when they're when they're working properly. Well, anyway, I hope that's gonna work. Let me see crystals. Do I have okay? I have sixteen, so it's only done it once. How many spikes do we have? Because it sent quite a few there. Okay, so let's go ahead and turn some of these into crystals. I want to get those uh, spawners all evened out because that would be cool, I think. So let's go ahead and turn this off. Uh, I believe we finished all of the other side, so we just need to come over here. Ouch. And put eight on each of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There we go. All right. Now all of those should be good to go. How are we doing over here with lutations? We're doing solid. That's how we're doing. Oh, yeah. All of these are leveled up more. We are out of glowstone. Interesting. Well, progress. Progress was made today with ATM stars and with this here, with the farm. So that was good. That was good stuff. And we started working on the bees. Let's check our draconic. We only have three draconic dust after all of that. We're going to need a lot more if we want to get into making more bee stuff. How many combs do we have? 32. So we have 32 combs. So we can make more of the time thingies here i think we can only make one though yeah we can only make one but that is fine we'll put that on the regular bees so we get more more combs coming through from them i also want to set it up to what the hell the zombie we're getting more bees where are we getting all these bees from are they just they're just showing up and Chillin'? Is that what's happening here? Okay. I I ain't mad at it. Shit. I'm not mad at that. Oh, I need to make another expansion box. Damn. Um, honeycomb. Do we have any more honeycomb anywhere? We do. We have some in there. Damn, we have a whole bunch of bees. I didn't even know that. That's crazy. Well, we need to make the hive or the expansion box. So let's go ahead and try to make... The spruce expansion box. Oh, that's right. It uses spruce expansion box. Let's make two of these so we can go ahead and ch change these. This one has the zombie and the prospera bee. Let's break that and break this one. We'll do this and this. So now this has more space. And I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, damn it. It took my sturdy bee cages. I'm supposed to be able to put this here and it grabs the bee, but can I? I'm gonna have to upgrade that pipe, huh? So I can filter so it doesn't take it. This is just so I can put a filter on it. Blacklist. This. Don't take that out. Okay, so now it should just put my bees in here, right? In the bee cage? The zombie looks so weird. It should be I should be able to just take them out with this. Hmm. Well, anyway, let's just check this in here then. Okay. Prospera bees, we have one more in here, and a zombie again. What are, you landed? That looks so weird with you on the ground. Don't mess with the draconic bees, zombie. They'll mess you up. They will, I'm telling you. Does this not work? Can I not take them out like this? Oh well. Well Okay. All right, then. Now I need to decide what I want to do next. We're getting a ton of guardian spikes, but we're not getting anything else. It's not, is it not going into here? It's all going into here, but why? Is it because it's at the end of the chain? Hmm. It might be trying to fill that one up first. I'm unsure. Anyway... Anyway, anyway, at least we're still getting spikes, which means we're still getting crystals. So that's good. 
Unfortunately, we ran into those world problems, but we are resolved. We're back and things are fine. We lost the puffer fish, which really sucks, but that's okay. Everything else was recovered. We made some more progress. We're getting closer to the ATM star in some fashions. We're getting some systems set up. We have a new reactor, which is going absolutely nuts in the power department. We have the chunk destroyer, which is going absolutely crazy. Let's go ahead and check on that to see how that's doing. Oh, yeah. Dude, look how much it's done. Oh, it missed this because uh, the power went out. <laughs> that random strip right there. We're going to have to manually mine that out. Anyway, it's making a ton of progress. Look at all that all the modium down there. And the reason all the modium is down there is because quarries cannot mine it. So we're going to have to go down there and manually mine all of that. But that is something that we'll do next time. Thank you all again so much for watching. I hope you all take care and I will see you all in the next one. Goodbye.